Adsorption Chromatography. It is based on the principle of differential adsorption. Different compounds are adsorbed, on an adsorbent, to different degrees. There are two main types of adsorption chromatography. Column chromatography. And thin layer chromatography. Let's have a look at column chromatography. It involves separation of a mixture, over a column of adsorbent. The stationary phase is a solid, like alumina, silica gel, etc. A slurry of the solid, is filled in a long glass tube, provided with a stopcock, at its lower end. The mixture to be separated, is dissolved in a suitable solvent. And the solution is poured, over the adsorbent column. As the solution moves down, the compounds are adsorbed on different parts of the column. The most readily adsorbed compounds are retained near the top. And other compounds come down, to various distances in the column. Thus resulting in complete separation. The adsorbed compounds, are then eluted by the passage of a series of eluents that is solvents. The compounds at the bottom of the column, which are less readily adsorbed, are desorbed first. And more readily adsorbed compounds, at the top are desorbed, later. The solutions of these compounds, are collected in different containers. On evaporation of the solvent, the different compounds are recovered.